This is Twit. My app, we were talking about automation earlier, and Flo's going to talk a little more about smart home automation and kind of larger things like that. But whenever I think of automation, I think of things like IFTT, and but then I think about Tasker and Locale, which are apps that are very popular, everybody loves. And I'll be honest with you, they intimidate the hell out of me because they seem to be very hard to, you know, you figure out the recipe and how everything works and stuff like that. Um, I was looking and found uh, it's a little bit of an older app. It's been around for a while, um, but it's called Automate. Uh, very simple, Automate. Um, not the app called Automate with a capital M, which was a driving travel app that was previously in the show. Uh, this is a different Automate. Uh, but basically, it's similar to Tas Tasker um, in that it allows you to use your device to set up automatic kind of recipes uh, for you to uh, trigger based off your phone. But it does it in a visual kind of way, a flowchart kind of way. So if you go to create a new recipe, th they have a series of building blocks and you have this whole kind of little graph that you're working on. And if you hit the uh, menu in the upper left-hand corner, Corner, you can reveal the various building blocks you have, right? So you can um, you can choose from whether apps, your battery, camera, all those sort of things, and you can tap one and pull it onto the onto the the the, uh, the field, and so now you can move it anywhere you want on the on that area, and if you long press on the uh, oh yeah, so you just connected the beginning of that to so when battery level, right? And then now you can set what should happen when the battery level is. Um, you know, so when it's charged, when it gets down to 25%, you can set whatever you want it to be, right? Okay, so now and, it would go up here. Yep, and, and then have something happen, you know, like whether you want to, uh, let's maybe change the interface. We can change the, uh, let's change the color. There we go, color pick. Let user pick a color. <laughs> so there All we right. go. And then now you can long press on that and make the connection. So when the battery level is 66%, then you can edit that to change the pick the color to change the color of whatever you want to do. Okay. Basically, it allows you to build these flowcharts of automation based off things. So what you could do is you could say you could build a location based one. So when I'm home, turn on Wi-Fi. Like that's the usual one that we kind of give the example for. But you could also be like when I come home, turn on the Wi-Fi and send a text message to my wife saying I'm home. You could do things like that. Basically, you with this whole set, you can access every function within your app. Uh, within your within your phone um, and the great interesting thing is that a it's visual so if you're more of a visual designer or a visual learner or something like that these great kind of flow charts that you can connect in are, are there it's extremely powerful and there's a whole community and a whole library of ones to tap into already if you if you don't want to actually do them you can go access uh, uh, the, everyone else that has been doing it uh, and creating these already and you can tap into that as well so, um, yeah, so it's called Automate. It's free in the Google Play Store. If you want to get into automation based off your device to have certain things happen when you go places or when you do certain things, um, you can do that. So there you go. Nice. Automate. That is Automate. Automate yep. by Llama Lab, yep. I think is the, the, the creator of that. Right on.